Well, it's a glorious autumn day here at Stowhill, and here comes a really lovely boat. She's called the Skylark. She's 58 feet long, cruises stern, and she's only four years old. She was built in 2019 by Calden Boats and fitted out by Brazel Narrowboats. Lovely lines to her, I think. The paintwork's in really good condition. Nice and shiny. There's Cindy on the back. I thought there were two of them when they started the drive past. <laughs> I think we might have a man overboard. The cruiser stern itself is, is a good size. It's over seven feet long. She was last blacked in August this year, 2023. Seven feet long, that cruiser stern. We'll have a look in the engine room on the way through. It's a mixture of portholes and bus style windows on the boat. She feels really light and airy, this boat. Side hatch there in the kitchen. So she's just been blacked. Four anodes on her. They were satisfactory at blacking. The well deck's a good size actually, just short of five feet long. Nice area to sit out and do whatever you do when you're sitting out. There's a seat here under which are the guts for the bow thruster. It's a Vita 75 kgf bow thruster. That was the water tank. It's integral, 682 litres. And the uh, front doors are glazed, as are those bulkheads. So we'll go in and have a look. And you can just see how light and airy she feels. Really nicely done out. I love this boat. It's a huge saloon, actually. 14 feet, 11 inches long. There's a 24-inch television on the wall there. This is a sofa bed. Storage underneath it, actually. Little cupboard there. And that's a bubble solid fuel stove in the corner there. Keeps the boat nice and toasty. Lovely curtains, I like these. There's a Houdini hatch in the roof here. Adds light and air. Head height on the boat is six foot five, so that's quite generous. All the lights are LED. The floor is oak throughout the boat. And she feels really cottagey with this freestanding furniture, I think. A couple of chairs there with a sweet little table. And the galley itself, again, is generously proportioned, seven feet, eight inches long. The worktops are oak effect laminate. There's the fridge. It's a two, 12 volt fridge mask with an ice box. Plenty of storage space on board. Stainless steel sink there. Storage underneath. And the cooking, there's a microwave in that recess there, and there's a three burner gas hob. It's a Thetford Midi Prima Mark III oven and grill and a 900 series three burner gas hob. There's a fly screen there for the side hatch. And on the starboard side of the boat, little work server or shelf there and the cupboard underneath. So everything you need in here really, apart from staff, but you can sort that out. You can feel how roomy she feels there. Good size cupboard here, like a good larder cupboard. You could probably put a washing machine in there. I've not measured it up, but um, if you wanted one, that would be a good starting point. Right, the bedroom's in here, 10 feet, seven inches long. Again, it feels really roomy and light and airy. Freestanding chest of drawers, another little chair there. Rattan chair, I think they're called. Lots of storage under the bed. The bed itself measures six foot three by four foot six. Of course, the sofa bed offers a spare double berth as well. Did I say, I can't remember, 10 feet seven, the bedroom, so it's good size again. Right, the bathroom's in here. The loo is a Thetford cassette, there's a spare cassette on board. Very large mirror on that bulkhead there, ceramic countertop sink. And the shower's here, there is a new shower curtain for the shams of light over. You've got the radiators on board. Central heating's a Wabasto diesel fired system to four radiators. There's the inverter, a three kilowatt inverter charger, Victron, that gives you 230 volts, as does the landline. Various isolation switches in there. Up onto the back deck. The engine, we'll have a look at it in a minute, it's only got 83 hours on the clock. So I'm not even running really. 
gas bottles in there. There's only one six kilo, but there's room for two. The engine room itself in here is a Beta Marine 38 PRM gearbox. Battery bank, there are four 95 amp hour ledger batteries, one starter, and there's two batteries for the bow thruster as well. There's the bow thruster controls. To wander back through, hot water is heated by the engine, the diesel central heating, there's also an immersion heater on board. All the lighting's LED, there's a galvanic isolator on board. I've mentioned landline hookup. Love this boat. Feels quite cottagey. And there we go. She comes with all the necessary navigation equipment to just turn the key and go. So there we go. Really, really lovely boat, I think. She's called the Skylark. For further photos, fully downloadable colour brochure and the price, go to our website, www.rugbyboat.co.uk.